YouTube, what up? Right now we got the Iowa versus South Carolina the championship game. This was yesterday, and that shit will turn. I watched it from beginning to end, and I was gonna watch the ESPN highlights, but that shit like 17 minutes long, and I just don't feel like going through that whole thing. I just really just wanted to get my take on the game, and just this is the house of highlights, and I only got six minutes, which I'm gonna do, so I'm gonna uh, try to get through my takes real quick with substance as well. And uh, Caitlin Clark, she had a phenomenal. Um, college career, she's gonna be the number one pick. You know, everybody talking about, everybody talking about, is she gonna pick the big three or is she, is she gonna pick the W? Bro, she ain't finna fuck with Ice Cube, bro. You know, what I'm you know what I'm saying. Even though it's five million, which I believe Ice Cube ain't bluffing, but she ain't finna pick Ice Cube over the WNBA. Even if she do to make less less money the first year, and she's still gonna get endorsements. She probably, she's probably still might make five million alone. Her first, like, off endorsements, you know what I'm saying? Including her WNBA salary. But five mil is five mil. You know, you get, you know, you could potentially make 10 mil, but she ain't finna fuck with Ice Cube. I just don't think that's realistic. You know what I'm saying? So, now, Juju, now, I'm, that might be a different story. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, uh, South Carolina, man, I was going for South Carolina. I'm going to the shower with 100. Majority of, white, majority of white people was going for Iowa. And majority of everybody was going for South Carolina if you was black. That's just how it is. There's nothing racist about it. It's just you ride with your race. And I was, uh, you know, I've been cheering for Kayla Clark pretty much the whole season. Besides when she played LSU, because I actually like LSU. I was going for LSU last year. But... You know, I be I like Iowa. I love Kayla Clark. She's the greatest basketball player, female basketball player I've ever seen. And she's American. What I like about her, she's white and she's American. So she's gonna turn like the market behind that, the machine that's gonna get behind her. Cause we had some white superstars, Luca, Dirk Nowitzki, Jokic, but they not from America. So Kayla Clark, she from America. So and she ain't like her attitude. You know what I'm saying? She kind of got like a little spicy attitude, and I like that. You know what I'm saying? And uh, South Carolina, they, you know, shout out to the coach. Uh, she gave, she's very classy. But I can tell she's real. She gave uh, immediate props to Kayla Clark. Like, she, she's revolutionized the game, which she has. And uh, she had a great scheme. We don't get in this girl's face. We gonna, we gonna stop this shit. She ain't finna run through us. Even though they was, even though they were locking, even though they was being very, very physical with her, which that's what LSU should have done. That's what Flage should have been doing. So the, the point, I'm going to show y'all what's going to get to. I ain't going to do too much talking. Why my car to be looking like that, man? Yeah, that's the best it's going to get? What's going on with my quality these days, man? The past, the past couple of videos. Nah, dog. Man, I apologize, y'all. But uh, but Iowa actually came out gunning. I'm talking about it was like seven zero. They came out gunning, but they just the difference was we we was getting a lot of boards. And um, uh, what's her name? I keep it was it started with a C, but she just she's six seven, bro. She just big. And what I like about Kayla Clark the most is no matter what team she be, she been playing against, she always shows up. And like I said, they were very physical with her, but she still had thirty. You know what I'm saying? Like she was, they was, they was getting really, really physical with her. Like the point guard, right here in the, right here, she was in her face. She was doing exactly what LSU should have been doing. She had a hand up. She, you know what I mean? Cause she, she gonna shoot that motherfucker. And what I like about Kelly Clark is she always got a head up. She always got a head up. She always spot up the open man, and she's like. When she, you know, as soon as she get the rebound, her eyes is open. She gonna fling that motherfucker. She, she wanna advance it. Right. I, I can't. I can't. No matter which, no matter what Kelly Clark does, and shout out to the freshmen. The freshmen, man, they were showing up. That's the reason why we won, including the big man. Uh, the freshmen. Johnson and then the other one, number twelve. I can't, I can't remember her name, but they both were showing up. They was bringing the intensity. They was, they weren't shying away from the moment. They were, they were playing good defense. And this is what I'm talking about. She was playing very physical defense, and she only had like two fouls or three fouls, so she did a great job. She did what she had to do. Cause Kelly Clark gonna get her points. It's just you know how many points are we gonna let her have? 
Or we, we gotta make it difficult for her. You can't stop that. She too big. You can't stop that. It's all right. You know, shout out to Iowa. They had a great season, though, for sure. And somebody in my last comments was like, why do you automatically assume that LSU was the better team than Iowa? Fam, the a a a SEC is just a superior conference, period. I feel like they you were just trying to lead somewhere else as far as racial. I feel like. But I'm talking about SEC in general. The SEC always been uh, superior. I mean, no matter what sport, in my opinion. I, I, I rock with SEC. <laughs> That's straight up. And the white girl for uh, South Carolina, she did a phenomenal job. You know, I ain't, I ain't see her the whole year. Ooh, I must have been tripping. Like, I saw her get on the court. I'm like, damn, where she come from? You know what I'm saying? Why? So Kelly Clark just did a phenomenal job, man. Phenomenal college career, college career, all the accolades. She's uh, acclaimed. Pow, 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 pow. That's a great take. And like I said, man, this is the, you can just tell the difference between LSU's game plan in South Carolina's. And they just had a better personnel. Like, all them girls, they are dogs. South Carolina is some dogs. Like, when I was, I was going, I was rooting for LSU when we were playing South Carolina when that fight broke out. But ever since then, I'm like, okay, these girls ain't nothing to play with. They ain't nothing to play with. Straight up. You know what I'm saying? So, and that's where I became a fan. And then they was the SEC. I'm like, yeah. I'm like, yeah. Let me make sure. Let me double check. Oh, okay, yeah, they are SEC. I'm sorry from the say, yeah. I was trying to, yeah, I was trying to make sure. But yeah, that hell right here, my mama, she showed up, fam, and showed out. And she a Johnson like me. You know, us Johnsons, we don't play. Fuck! Yeah. Tessa Johnson. And like I said, Iowa was playing a phenomenal game. They were making the right plays. It's just they were turning the ball over because we was applying pressure, you know what I'm saying, uh, in the front court. You know, exactly what we should have been doing. LS, oh my, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's what, it'd, be, it'd be little shit like that that you got to capitalize off of. This, this is winning plays right here. Like, you see her fall? She ain't, hesit she ain't hesitating. I'm finna go. And not only did she go, but she hit the jump shot. And that's beautiful. You can't do nothing with that, man. She's too big, man. I think she's going to the draft as well. I think she a senior. Yeah. And that and and Shawty right here, she everywhere she need to be. Look, she got her hand up. And she gonna make that. That's cool, but that's great defense. She's gonna make that. But you just gotta have a hand up. LSU didn't have a hand though. They were just, oh my god.
And this is a great play right here. She's going to take the ball. She's going, I'm going to the rack. Now, I really don't think that was a foul. That was kind of like a ticky-tack foul. But, hey, it is what it is. Yeah, she was off the whole game. I think she was like one of 12, bro. You know what I'm saying? But she did she did her job, which was to try to contain Kaitlyn Clark as much as possible. And like I said, man, shout out to Kaitlyn Clark. She's done a lot for the game. And she's going to – I hope she does – because there's some girls hating on her. Some WNBA players tomorrow. So, man, this is a different reality. There's levels to this shit. Man, she finna cook, y'all, bro. <laughs> and I, I swear to God, I hope she do. She If she come out, the, she going to get a signature shoe. I'm man, I'm here for. It. I'm ready. I'm I, I'm ready. And then we don't gotta wait long for the. I ain't, I ain't never been this excited to anticipate for the WNBA in my whole entire life. I'm 24. In my whole entire life, I ain't never been this excited. And I think the WNBA they start. I'm say when that season start. I think they should start in June. When. Damn, they stay, they start May 19th. That's next month. So we ready for <laughs> sure. But now, um, y'all drop a dollar in my cash app. I'm gonna fuck with y'all, man. I'm out of here.